demonstration on how to do integration on a TI-55, particularly TI-55-2 or 3 calculators, um, which were released back in the 80s. And we're going to integrate something very simple, x cubed uh, dx from 0 to 3. Step 1 is we're going to need to partition the calculator so we have at least 3 registers. And we do that by pressing 2nd, learn, uh, which is, becomes the partition uh, command, and then 3. You'll need at least 3. And most will have 40 steps to enter our integrand. Then we're going to enter the integrand. First press it, reset to go back to step 0 and then learn. And then enter your integrand. If you're going to use the uh, independent variable, use recall 1. It is important that you end the integrand with three keystrokes, equals, run stop, and reset. To calculate this integral, you're going to store the lower limit, or A, in register 1, the upper limit, uh, B, in register 2, then you're going to press the integral key, and then the number of partitions, which is anywhere from 1 to 99, and press run stop. Going back to my example, uh, the integral for, of, of x cubed from 0 to 3, and this is the program we're going to type. Uh, the power 3 equals run stop reset. Okay, for this short demonstration, I'm going to first partition the memory, so second partition 3. Now I got 40 steps and 3 memories. You are required to have at least 3 memories for integration on the TI-55-3. Okay, so we're going to go into learn mode. I'm going to reset to point the, put the pointer at step 0. And I'm going to hit learn. And I'm going to enter my integrand. So here's my power key and then 3. And then the 3 required uh, ending uh, step. So equals, run stop, reset. And let's check our work. So I'm going to go back out into programming, uh, a calculator mode, I hit reset. I'm going to go back to learning mode and I'm going to use a single step to make sure I have it right. So 45 is the power key at step 0. 3 is what I want for step 1. 95, that's equals. 12 for reset and then 22, uh, uh, 12 for run stop, and then 22 for reset. Everything looks good. I'm going to go back into calculator mode. On my integrand, the lower limit's 0, the upper limit's 3. So I'm going to store 0 in uh, memory 1, and then 3 in uh, memory 2. And I'm going to use 12 partitions, so I'm going to use the integrand button integral. I'm going to hit 12. And then I'm going to hit run stop, and it's going to take some time uh, for the calculator to process the integral. It's not, back in the 80s, integrals did take time. It was, it's not instant as we, we have now with today. So you're seeing the uh, TI-55-3 working its um, calculations, and it's still integrating. And now the TI-55-3 stopped integrating, and we have our answer, 20.25. Folks, that is how integration works on the TI-55-3. It's very similar on the TI-55, the TI-55-2, classic uh, calculator from Texas Instruments. I will leave the uh, steps in the description. And I'd like to thank uh, Robert Wilm Shinoni, I hope I'm pronouncing your name correctly, for suggesting that I do this demo. And I hope everyone has a good day.